What's going on, gang? Bolt Matrix here, and today we are taking a look at Julian Holtzman from the new Ghostbusters movie. I picked this figure up at Toys R Us. The overall aesthetic of the figure and the overall design of the figure is quite good and is very, very accurate to the movie. At least, I think it is. Haven't seen the movie yet. The proton pack on her back could use a bit more detailing, but it does work. And the overall look of the figure is, as I said, very good. The head sculpt is quite quite good and is very, very accurate to the movie. I think it even has a lip piercing. The figure's posability is pretty good, but the backpack is so darn heavy, it is top heavy. Head is on a, well, swivel. There is a series of hinges in the shoulder, a swivel and hinge in the elbow. Hands do move, rotate. There is torso articulation. There is a series of hinges in the legs that make uh, for some very comical looks. Swivel at the thigh, 90 degree bend at the knee, and a little bit of foot articulation. So you can pose the figure, but not very well. The plastic is really, really not that good. It reminds me of Thundercats. The Thundercats figures from a few years ago, it is that very cheap feeling plastic that just does not feel good. Now I'm looking at the box here, I'm trying to figure out, oh, it was a, it's a Mattel figure, ah, no wonder. None of the Mattel figures I've ever, I've ever played with or gotten in the past couple of years have felt good at all. Aesthetic wise, the figure is spot on, but quality wise? Uh, I don't know. It browns or the khakis of her pants are actually different colors for each leg versus the top of the leg. And oh, the plastic doesn't feel good in the hand. I know a lot of folks hate that, but it's true. It, it doesn't feel good. It doesn't feel solid except for the torso and the legs. The arms feel not good at all. Overall, it's a good looking figure. Quality-wise, mm, I'd be really worried about it lasting more than a year or so. So gang, I think this is worth picking up if you're a fan of the new Ghostbusters. Uh, otherwise, as a toy, I would stay away. So, hope you've enjoyed this video review. As always on Bolt Matrix, ask you to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will catch you next time.